talk about some solar. Last time on Sailing Music and Lyrics. We still haven't found the problem. Bummed. Very, very bummed. Three electronics engineers on this boat trying to figure out this problem. Eight days of trying to troubleshoot the problem, only to find out, at considerable expense we might add, that the problem was actually uh, a faulty ground from salt water getting into it. Our videos are not just for us to look back on later there for you. And if you enjoy them and want to see more, join the band on Patreon. So when we installed the solar panels, um, basically I chose uh, the highest output that I could get for the reasonable, most reasonable uh, amount of money. And basically it, it worked out to LG's 360 watt uh, solar panels, their, their new neon ones. And they were under $500 a piece. Uh, the output has been really, really good. They are 36 and a half volt uh, panels, and they have really served well. I had to have some brackets made. Um, basically, I, so I have uh, I have some some pretty hard and fast. Uh, beliefs as it were for uh, how solar panels should be installed um, my system is is pretty simple but com more complex than than most other systems in the fact that we go from each panel is in parallel so each panel is one panel goes to a breaker and then it goes to the solar controller and then it goes to another breaker that from there then it goes into a bus bar to the batteries. Each solar panel can be pulled out of the system with the breaker in case there's a problem with the solar panel. If the MPPT controller, the, the solar controller, uh, if one of those is bad, I can isolate it. And if for some reason it's back feeding, I can isolate it uh, for, and potentially stop any damage from happening to the solar panel by blowing both or popping both breakers on either side of it um, and of course afterwards in case I need to stop anything from going into the batteries I think that that's how all solar systems um, should be built uh, you may have your own version of, of what you think works I'm not a fan of the flexi panels uh, I've heard too many cases where they catch boats on fire, people putting them on top of canvas. Uh, and unless you put them on some, some honeycomb plastic so that they can get air flowing through them, I would tell you to stay away from those. If you've got room uh, to put hard panel, solar panels on your boat, definitely do it. Put an arch on your boat. Um, they're, they're not very hard. To, to put on. Um, you can have them custom built. You can have one like mine that's adjustable and you know fits on a wide range of boats. Uh, but make sure that you preload them. You know, squeeze the, the, um, the arch together uh, when, it, when you mount it. So you build it actually a little bit too wide, about five or six inches wider than what you need, and then squeeze the bottom in. And then when you mount it, then it doesn't rock. Um, I've had this this system right here has been in 50 knots or more while we're sailing we, we've been in 50 knots um, we've seen 60 I didn't have the solar panels on when we were in, in 62 knots um, it's made it through Dorian you know with the panels on it but we weren't getting anything over 50 that I was aware of or I would have taken the panels off when we got caught in the storm uh, off of off of Georgia I, I, I didn't know what was going on we just got we just got Rick rolled <laughs> um, but yeah everything held up fine I've had 
absolutely no problems with uh, with the quality of the solar panels themselves so basically it's been a, a very good system it's 1440 watts so 1.44 kilowatts um, like I said each cell is or each panel uh, is a 36 and a half volt um, sorry it, it, it each panel outputs 36 and a half volts at peak at, at peak like right now um, I'm kind of in the shade a little bit but if I move uh, you can see that we're in, in pretty good sun right now and uh, I will I'll pull up the uh, the Bluetooth apps uh, the, the only thing about the Bluetooth app that Victron has that that I, I'm not a big fan of is you can only get to one uh, one controller at a time so you can't look at like all four controllers in conjunction or you know all together unless you have the color controller which I did put everything together um, recently this is a, a this is the, the second build uh, I can get into that later but with the with the whole lithium configuration that we just did um, all of that's been put together um, the, the solar panels were put on last year, so I've got had a year of, of experience with them, and the only only thing I, I would have to say would be more power, more, more power. There's 400s out now. Um, get them. Seriously. If you've got the room, the higher the, the, the power uh, output that you can get, the more benefit that you're going to get out of it. Um, I don't think there's... Uh, a such of a thing as as too much solar if you've got room for 5,000 watts of solar put 5,000 watts of solar on there you will never ever ever have too much um, if you can keep your batteries topped up all the time that means that you'll be able to do things that e that I can't do even now with my my new system that I can and basically I can power a small city with the whole with the lithium and everything we'll get into the, the lithium in, in another episode but um, as far as the, the solar panels go and the installation the installation was I want to say smooth I'm not gonna throw the company under the bus I'm also not gonna name them but um, they just they took longer than than I had anticipated um, than they had anticipated and um, it, but either way uh, like I said, it was, it was, it was. A, I'm very happy with the products. Um, I've had to do some reconfigurations since the install, but uh, yeah, it's a good system. A lot of power right now. Um, I've only ran into two boats of similar size, um, and I'll say similar size, anything under 60 foot. I'm 44 and a half, um, but. At 60 foot, I think I'll, I'll throw that in there. And I've I've only had two boats with more solar capacity, uh, wattage wise, than than what we have here on Music and Lyrics. And I am unapologetically happy about that. Um, I wish I had more. If I could have squeezed the fifth panel in there, I think I probably would have figured it out. But as you can see, we're already just slightly over the edges a little bit. I'll grab a in case I didn't get that in the other videos. I'll, I'll grab some of that so you can actually see but um, yeah there were some some problems like I said with the install but as far as the, the products themselves go I'm very 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 happy uh, I've had no problems with that part of this whole system it's really good um, I'll put some data sheets um, in the video as as we're going by so you can can take a look at what they are if you have any questions um, I, 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 I'm, I know that I'm missing something in this video so if you have any questions just leave a comment below I will get back to you as fast as I can um, and answer any questions that you might have so I will talk to you guys in the next episode take it easy guys I'm gonna have to piece this together because I really don't know what's going on. I, my brain keeps stopping as I'm talking. Um.